Jonathan Lee Riches, a.k.a. JLR. Justice for Summer Wells. She's been missing since June 15th, 2021. Where is Summer Wells? Has anyone uh, wondered who the private investigator or private investigators uh, are that are working for Don and Candace Wells? Well, I think I found out who they are. Um, if you go to the findsummerwells.com uh, webpage uh, about missing Summer Wells, you'll see a post on there, um, private investigator for tips. And you can leave tips on you know anything in, re- in, in reference to Summer Wells, uh, Summer Wells tips at charter.net. Uh, this is the supposed private investigator for Don and Candace Wells. Well, check this out. Um, I'm going to show you some posts and you know contacts that I had with the private investigator behind this email. Uh, let me know what you think. Check this out. So I'm a member in all the Summer Wells groups on Facebook. Uh, I go through the postings and the comments regularly just to see what pops up. Um, any new information, any clues, you know, someone that knows something. Uh, I saw this post recently. Um, it was by a Mary Witt, and she asked, who is their PI? Candace is always uh, my PI. Who is it, and what are they doing? Something tells me it's not, it's no one legit. And the response, an individual responded to Mary Witt's post and said, Chris and Trudy Colba from CNC Investigations. They are legit PIs, but unsure why a PI would even take a personal interest in a case like this, unless they were asked to. They have managed to stay off the radar. They have previously talked about the Evelyn Boswell case, amongst other Tennessee missing persons, such as Luke Vance. So now check this out. So I reached out to Chris and Trudy Colbaugh, um, I sent them a text and I'm going to read you what I said and I'll go through their responses. Uh, Friday, March 25th, 2022. Good morning. Jonathan Riches with the original media group. It's my understanding you CNC investigations have been doing PI work for Don and Candace Wells trying to locate Summer Wells. Any new leads recently? Are you open to receiving leads? Also, are you working with the Wells on a pro bono basis? Uh, Thank you for your time. Uh, They respond back pretty quickly. Uh, We do not discuss any case or client we may have. It is my understanding that there is a direct email to the private investigator working on the Wells case on their family website for anyone with credible tips and that are uncomfortable reporting these directly to the TBI tip line. I suggest if you have credible tips to contact TBI. I respond. Thank you. I would like to give the PI a credible tip that should seriously be looked at. They respond. Summer Wells tips at charter.net. The same um, email that is on the findsummerwells.com uh, webpage. So uh, this came from C and C investigations. So Chris and Trudy Colbaugh, uh, private investigators actually worked on the Evelyn Boswell case in Johnson City, Tennessee, a couple years back. Um, as you could see, you know, they didn't verify with me that they were the Summer Wells uh, investigators, but they knew where to uh, direct me. And they also knew the uh, email on the findsummerwells.com web page. So, I mean, that makes me believe that they are, in fact, the private investigators working on the Summer Wells case. Who are they? Why are they working on the case? Uh, are they working on a pro bono basis? Uh, does anyone have any information about these individuals? Um, are they good for the case or are they bad for the case? Let me know your thoughts, uh, comments, any suggestions, you know, uh, comment. Uh, Chris and Trudy Colbaugh seems to be the private investigator for Don and Candace Wells.